Greetings, people of the world! Matthew back with you for the continuation of Let's Play Final Fantasy X. So, we have just successfully completed the third Cloister of Trials over here at the Jose Temple of Yevon. But now it's time to continue our journey in order to defeat Sin. And the next stop for that is the Moonflow, so let's be on our way. Oh, hey. oh the Summoner doesn't talk and there are... wow. You can't defeat Sin with Machina, the Summoners are, only, are our only hope. Yeah, they are. Yevon's teachings are the way. The Crusaders were fools for defying them. Here, take this, I don't need it anymore. A halberd, okay. Alright, well, I believe that is equipable to Titus? Um, no, it's not Titus. Okay, no, it's for um, Kimari, but he's got a better one. Okay. Fair enough, fam. What about you? The Crusaders have fallen apart, so I'm going to help out with guard duty here at the temple for a while. It's the least I can do to repay them for taking us in. Oh, you don't give anything? Okay. Then, we shall be on our way. Unless there are more people I can talk to, like you. I beat myself up all night for taking part in that disastrous operation. Then a monk told me that if I had time for Morse, I should spend it praying. Here, he's right. It's my duty to pray for my departed men. The monk gave me this, but I think you should have it. Yes, I should. Ten potions will definitely help me. And what about you? The Crusaders deeply regret their actions. I believe it's time to put the past behind us and forgive them. Yevon shall forgive those who seek redemption. Should you need a place to recuperate, please return. You are always welcome here. And we get two high potions. Not bad. Off so early? Lady Yuna, you must be exhausted after working so hard last night. Will you be okay? Well, she does have a job to do. I feel that I have rested enough. But thank you for your kindness. Will you be leaving too? Yes. First we cross the moon flow, and then we head north in search of chocobos to replace those we have lost. Well, good luck on that. Chocobos, our mounted forces will ride again. Huh? Aren't you missing someone? Yeah, Clasco. <laughs> Speaking of which, there he is. What took you so long? We're leaving. Put yourself together, man. You expect me to keep up with a chocobo? Lady Yuna, I wish you good fortune. Elma, Clasco, let's go. Ma'am. Hey, can I just rest a sec? Come on, rookie. No you gotta, yeah, pull yourself together. Yeah, you gotta pull yourself together, rookie. Alright, so now we can leave the Jose Temple of Yevon grounds and proceed northward after cutscene. You know where we gotta go. Gotcha. Moonflow, baby, here we come. Why the heck was Waka freaking out? That was weird. But our path down the Moonflow is officially underway. Definitely some of my favorite music in the game comes from the Moonflow. I just like the tranquil nature of it. Oh, hello there. It's not much of a wound. I should be able to go on, but I can't. Okay, it doesn't look like these people will give me anything, but I do see Shalinda off on the horizon. And, yeah, I was thinking, we're up against a big adversary, aren't we? And we are. Okay, um... Well, let's have Titus eliminate the little guy. And let's have Waka... Um... Yeah, let's dark this thing. It is an Ochu, but I guess it's not gonna work like that. Um... Lulu, come on in. Because I'm going to need so you to you start burning. I'm going to need you to do a lot of burning. 1400 points. And a smack to Waka. Alright, let's get Kimari in here. Give him an opportunity to... I want to see what happens when he uses Lancet. And you may have noticed he has cheer. I have him going up... Um. Titus's path do, do I have for Kimari? Alright, Oren. Come on here and get some points. Um, let's power break it. Wham! 
Well, Yuna, why don't you come in here and finish things off? Summoner Yuna, ready. Um, well, why don't we show off Ixion? Might as well give him a chance to get a, some time in the spotlight. I mean, we did just acquire him, so I guess it makes sense. And thrust the wands in a 180. And bring Ixion through the electrical portal. And 180 the other way. Ixion breaks on through to the other side. My name's Yuna. Pleased to meet you. Well, we're pleased to meet you too. Alright. And you come equipped with... Whoa! You're a lot stronger than I thought you were. 7,200 points. Okay, well, let's not waste any time here. Ah, you, he was trying to poison me and he failed. Hit it again. Another 930 points. Oh, the Ochu dance. This is like a full cacophony of status ailments. But I'm able to hold my own. So let's hit again. 977. Yeah, just try me. Just try me, I dare ya. Oh, we almost hit a thousand! And then the Ochu dance. Of course, Ixion's not gonna feel a thing. Can Thunder end it? No, not quite. And one more Ochu dance for good measure. But it's gonna be all for naught. Finish him! So everyone scored, and Ixion pasted this fool like nobody's business. Two power spheres and a noxious kite sith. Alright, let's see how that works on Lulu. Um, Noxious Kite Sith. Poison Touch, okay, I don't necessarily need that. Okay. Fair enough. Oh, is this a treasure chest? Uh, if they show me a path, yeah, come on, let me walk down the path. So I can get three level one key spheres, alright. Hi, Shalinda, how are you? Good day, everyone. Good day, Shalinda. A lesson from what has happened to the Crusaders. Only the truly faithful have a hope of defeating sin. Well met, I guess, Miss Shalinda. We'll cross paths again, I'm sure. And I see two more people on the horizon. Okay, we got a couple of flyers here. Um, well, first of all... Let's just give Yuna a chance to score some points. And then, have Orin come on in, give a bit of a whack. And then, Kamari as well. And these things cast thunder. But, I can hold my own. Alright. Let's bring in Waka, because he is the master of the altitude adversaries. Um, Titus, you want to get in here and take a shot at this thing? <laughs> nah, I guess that's not going to fly. Literally. <laughs> and I guess the punishment is a... It's... I got what I deserved. Um... Yeah, let's bring Lulu back in. Um, I think it said this thing was weak to Fira, or the fire weapon magics. It doesn't matter, it's dead. And we have prevailed. Alright. Ooh, five mana spheres, that's a lot. Oh, it looked like someone's getting spun around. Hey, I remember these two guys from back in Luca. Yeah, we're not getting ability spheres from these guys. Anyway. Off to a cutscene, where Kimari's gonna have to intervene. Who was that in the middle? One of Kimari's friends. Looks just like him. What makes you so what? sure? Both follow summoners on all fours. Hornless goatlings. Hornless! Hornless! Well, you two are certainly bullies, aren't you? <laughs> As demonstrated by your laugh. Do insult Kimari. Wrong. We come to warn little Kimari. Why is that? Summoners disappear. Never return. 
Next will be Kimari's summoner. Is that a threat? Oh, Kimari lost his horn. Next, lose his summoner. Now, how did he lose his horn? Howl alone, howl alone. <laughs> wow, these guys are dark. You two are just like Donna, Those and she's a girl. Uh, got something against you? What? They were just picking on you? That's Kimari what they do. With them. And I'll help. Kimari alone. But, Why is that? Uh, it's Kimari's problem. You can't interfere. It's a rule. A Yevon thing? I'm worried. Let the Ronso deal with Ronso problems, yeah? <laughs> That's how it's always been. I mean, I'm worried about those summoners disappearing. Yeah, of course, can't overlook that. Hey, if we guardians do our job, no problem, right? Exactly. Ooh. Confident. Yeah. I mean, there's strength in numbers, you know. I mean, Yuna's got five guardians on her side. And we obtain the next potion. Now then, back to enjoying the music for a moment. Okay, we picked up a new... Um, equipable item for Lulu, the variable Mog. Want to know what that's all about. Magic plus 5%, plus it also offers new abilities. The ability to add new abilities. Now, it's been over 10 years, so I've completely forgotten how you add new abilities to weapons and armor. I should look that up on GameFAQs. Man, these Ochus just don't go away. Yikes. Um. Well, I guess the best thing I can do in this instance is to give some haste to Lulu. And then, we're gonna see... Um, okay, yeah, it's not a good idea to bring out a Freed in this situation. Only if I'm really desperate. Um, I'll just have... I'm gonna pray for everyone. Alright. Fira on the Ochu. Okay, it's this basic attack, which is fine by me. Fira this thing. Okay, yeah, don't worry, I know how to deal with you insects. Waka! Come on in! And here we go. And then, let's bring Kamari in. Get him off. Uh, take him out. Right. Another good burn. But of course, it comes at a price. An Ochu dance. But it's the, it's the price you have to be willing to pay in order to try and take this sucker down. Training, huh? Not quite. Ow! Um, Oren, you wanna get in here? So who's next? Um... Oh boy. You know what? You bring Yuna back in. Bring Yuna back in. If Freed's slow, but we need his help, because if we don't use it, this Ochu's gonna finish us off. Oh, but it still needs 2,500 more points. So we may get very little out of Ifrit. Oh, man. This is not good. Well, we'll take it as far as we can. Alright, I'm gonna get a little bit of... A, not, a little bit more distance. And that's all I need. Oh, it's gonna do it again! Oh, it would be so nice if I could eliminate this thing on this last round of fire. Come on! Yes! Oh! Ifrit, well done! Way to hang in there and survive! Well done! Um... Aeons... Um... I, w I wish I could heal him right now. 
Um, but I am a bit of a ways away from being able to do that anyway. Miss Yuna, if you could please heal everyone, because everyone could certainly use it. Alright. Take one to the right. And in here... Three more level 1 key spheres. Well, now I'm not so trepidatious as used to using them. Alright, this time it's not an Ochu, thank goodness. But we still get ambushed. Yeah. Alright, you asked for it. Um, I'm gonna hit you. First try this time. That's what I'm talking about. Haha! -ha! Yeah, I came at a price. Oh man, Titus is really feeling it right now. Um, gotta cure him. Keep him on his feet. And the pitch. Nice job. Titus, we need to get you out of here so that you can recover. Let's let Kimari finish this. Or maybe he won't. Well, he will get credited for being involved in the battle, so... Orin, you want to get in? Oh, wow. Man, we are having a hard time eliminating these things. There we go. That's more like it. I'm good, yeah? <laughs> well, you came through in the clutch. No question about it. Serum Arm Guard. That sounds like something worthwhile. And, you know what? For that matter, I should check what FC everyone has. Um, Metal Arm Guard. Serum Arm Guard. Um, well, considering where we currently are, I think Poison Ward is definitely a good idea right now. Um, don't have to worry about Stone Proof for now. Um... Guess we might as well increase our defense. Um, well, yeah, we definitely need Dark Ward because we have monsters that can cast that. Red, white, bright. Um, it's not gonna be that much of a concern if Lulu is darked because, of course, she's the magic caster. Um, yeah, we can figure more of this out later. Onward we go. Up and along the moon flow road. Yeah, I had to skip that battle intentionally because of the fact that um, I got ambushed by an Ochu and it Ochu danced me. Okay, so yeah, we're a little worse for wear again. Um, no, Yuna, Yuna. There we go, and we see Belgamine again. And you know what? I think we're going to battle her after a timeout. So I'm going to take a quick timeout and be right back. And I guess we'll lock horns with Belgamine in another Stool of Summoners. So don't go away.